Hi, welcome back. So, how to create additional countries and country codes, unit of measurements, regions, lot of other stuff, which is general in nature, irrespective of any SAP SD and sorry, any of SAP ECC or S4 HANA module. Let's try to check this today. Okay. So, probably like uh, experienced people aware of this one. There is one section called SAP Netweaver. So whatever the things we are going to define that will flow to irrespective of the modules. For example, uh, generally SAP will update. It is so accurate, but if you go back to the older, older versions, it's a bit difficult. Let's see this. Okay, this is the place where you can see this. This is in ECC, EHP 7, 7.4. So as for also, you will have the similar section called. So let's go to the general settings. For example, if you'd like to define any new country, okay, that you can able to define it. Suppose you have a certain package, right? So like, you know, you would like to change the name or long name or like uh, you would like to change certain countries. If it is US specific, the tick mark will be there and uh, your ISO code now, it was happening past few years, your ISO code and all those stuff actually, you know, if uh, certain sections need to be get updated according to, <clears throat> you know, base country level settings that you can able to do it. Let's go for our best country, India. So here you can see this, okay. So these names, if you want, you can able to change it Okay, so you future like, you know, if any updation came okay, at the point of time, like, you know, in uh, export or import forms, the country is flowing, the name is flowing. Okay, so if you'd like to change it, such a case as you will come to this. Generally, generally, we don't make any changes. It won't happen uh, that much easily. It takes years and years uh, for name changes and all those things. Probably it might not happen throughout your lifetime also. So like if you come here, you can able to insert regions if any new regions came okay if a certain state is divided into two states or three states such a case you can able to do this you can able to see this if anything is missing you would like to use it for your uh, sales transportation purchase related so yeah these are the codes they have given uh, so you can able to do that and apart from that you can able to define the country codes. Generally, for example, if you go for India, okay, it is uh, 91, okay, 0, 2, 0, 0, 2, 9, 1, okay, 91 plus. That is the thing, that's what it is saying. But certain, for example, if you see Jamaica, 0, 11, 2, 18, 0, 9, these many kind of, you know, based on the reason, country codes will be there. Such a case, you will have this kind of, uh, things you need to update it so you have a telix and all those things no one is using so you can able to define your uh, geo coding uh, mo mobile uh, properties okay so you can able to see this uh, the calendar maintenance and the time zones and you know all all relevant general settings which is required for the business you can able to define it okay that's all for today. If you like this video, you can subscribe. Uh, thanks for joining. Okay. So that's it for today. So, so like, uh, so I have around 2,800 uh, students till today. Like, you know, if you are not subscribed, you can subscribe uh, my course, SAP SD. In uh, plain English, uh, this is, you know, it's an offer. It's more than uh, 78 hours. You can able to see SAP SD rebates, SAP SD pricing, and stock transfer and intercompany sales with full confidence. SAP S4 HANA Simple Logistics uh, for business partners. So I have some set of courses available. So if you like it, you can subscribe it. This is one of the key courses for beginner getting master to write functional specification. I'm just providing all these links. If you'd like to enhance, you'll just take this opportunity. Um, okay. Thank you very much. Join for today.